The Prime Minister gave a press conference from Downing Street after the Supreme Court left his Rwanda plan in tatters. Rishi Sunak has promised emergency legislation and a new treaty with Rwanda after the policy was ruled unlawful by the Supreme Court. The Prime Minister said he will end the merry-go-round of legal challenges with a law to deem Rwanda a safe country. It comes after his pledge to stop small boats was dealt a major setback today after the UK's highest court earlier rejected the government's appeal over its scheme to send channel migrants on a one-way ticket to the East African nation. Speaking at a Downing Street press conference this evening, Mr Sunak said, I do not agree with this decision but I respect it and accept it. The rule of law is fundamental to our democracy. We have prepared for all outcomes of this case. And so we have been working on a new international treaty with Rwanda. This will provide a guarantee in law that those who are relocated from the UK to Rwanda will be protected against removal from Rwanda and it will make clear that we will bring back anyone if ordered to do so by a court. We will finalise this treaty in light of today's judgment and ratify it without delay. But we need to end the merry-go-round. I said I was going to fundamentally change our country, and I meant it. So I'm also announcing today that we will take the extraordinary step of introducing emergency legislation. This will enable Parliament to confirm that with our new treaty, Rwanda is safe. Mr Sunak, who is facing pressure from Tory MPs on the right of the party to pull the UK out of the European Convention on Human Rights, ECHR, said he would not let a foreign court block flights to Rwanda. He said, if the Strasbourg court chooses to intervene against the expressed wishes of Parliament, I am prepared to do what is necessary to get flights off. I will not take...